Hello, my name is Matt Rich. I am the Assistant Superintendent for Curriculum Instruction in Downers Grove School District, and this is a walkthrough of how we can use shared calendars to help our students and our families organize themselves within the school day. First, we go to www.icloud.com. I'm going to log in with my Apple ID. And as simple as that is, I'm in. Then I go to Calendar. And you can see I have the week view up because that's very helpful to me. And my wife and my two sons both have their calendars up here together. And so we can see how th we start to track things along the way. You can see in the calendar that you can keep different activities. You can have multiple things and you can turn them on or off by just clicking the check marks. This also works on any of your iOS devices. But we want to create a sharing opportunity. So I'm going to add a new calendar. So I go to the star here and we'll put new calendar. And we'll call this trial calendar. And I'm going to put a little event on our trial calendar. Uh, it's going to go on Stacy Calendar. I need to change that. So we'll go test event. And change that to our trial calendar. Beautiful green that's going to come up for us. Now that trial calendar only I can see unless I hit the broadcast button right here. And I can now have a private calendar. And I can add a person to this. We will add my son Cameron. Hit OK. Now Cameron and I can now both share this calendar. We can see it on our iOS devices, whether it's an iPad or an iPhone. Also, we can see it through iCloud.com. And we can add or delete events. If I ever want to delete it, we can either of us can delete the calendar also. So that's how you make a calendar. We hope that this has been very helpful for you. Thank you.